Hey, man. It's the ISO guy, Sensei, the greatest nigga on 2K in existence. And look, man, we got some very important things to talk about, some more 2K23 news. Make sure y'all like the video, man. It helps out the video a lot, but let's get right into it, man. So this Chuck, you know, he tweets out, hoping that in NBA 2K23, the meta is about getting open, not about who can hit the most lightlies. <laughs> You've changed, Chuck. What has happened to you? Y'all let me know if y'all would um, prefer a 2K like that. I have been preaching this since the beginning. We're talking <laughs> the beginning. Right when 18 came out, bro, the, the shooting skill gap ruined. The whole skill gap of the game ruined. None of these 2Ks are competitive at all because it became more about who can hit most of the contested shots and um, not who actually has the skill to get wide open. You know, just abuse the contest system because timing is extremely easy in 2K, especially with the best jump shots and all these badges, man. If you, if you have a game about just the most lightlies, bro, your game is going to be poor, man. For anyone that tries to enjoy it somewhat competitively, I'm not talking about the highest level, just like mid tier, bro. Like it's just gonna, it's going to piss you off. Like people who have the ability to get wide open deserve to see a significant success rate of their jump shots compared to someone who can barely get open and just wiggle a little bit, you know, you know, he can barely get open, you know, he's it's all by the it's all just a uh, you know, it's a uh, uh, you know, they can't just, you know, like, and they're wide open, man. There's a difference. There's a difference in skill and IQ. But Chalk was one of the people I used to go uh, back and forth with. That That's why we even got into it, man. Like, he, he told me 2K18 was, like, the best 2K. <laughs> I blocked him. <laughs> Bro, if you tell me 2K18, the best 2K that is better than 15, 16, 17... 14 I'm blocking you bro like like if we, we was cool I had to block him I blocked him bro I swear to god bro this is a real story <laughs> I swear to god we was in a group chat boy fuck out of here what the fuck <laughs> I'm not with the joke so if y'all didn't know it's finna be August <laughs> so um yeah the gameplay trailer is coming could be the first, could be the second, the third, you know, very soon. Mr. Cap and Obvious, you know. 2K Intel tweets out, gameplay trailer should be releasing soon. Can't wait to see Sweating and Duncan. Do y'all think this will be the year that they finally give us an actual gameplay trailer? Or will they keep disrespecting us? This guy says, soon as in today or soon as in a couple of days. 2K Intel says his guess would be a couple of days, but could be late this week or early next week, man. Y'all let me know down below if y'all are excited for the gameplay trailer. So Jimmy Butler done got um extensions, dog. Y'all let me know how y'all feel about this, man. This some double standard shit. All these bitches can rock all this weave and shit, but a nigga can't get extensions? You know, nigga saying he running from the grind, like that bitch nigga Lillard said. You know, niggas is running from the grind, but nigga, you running from, you don't, you don't want to be exposed that you can't win with other niggas. That's why you stay in there, nigga. Fuck you talking about, you not loyal, nigga. You scared. That's what it really is. But look, look at this shit. Look at this shit. It, it look clean. I ain't gonna hold you. I know this nigga in real life. It look clean. It look clean. You should have just grew your dreads out, my nigga. I don't know. Y'all let me know if y'all would ever get uh, extensions down below, bruh. It looked clean. I guess he took it out because niggas was clowning him. June 29th, June 27th. Damn. <laughs> Damn. Your hair fucked up, nigga. You should have stuck with them other shits. Freddie Gibbs, funny ass, tweeted this out. Now, my boy. Hold on. Okay, this is kind of zesty, bro. Is this why you did this? Gay. Why do... <laughs> Bro, y'all, y'all be, y'all be low key. Y'all be showing y'all the y'all, y'all so foo foo boy. Like, bro, look, look at this. What the fuck? Wait, hold on, hold on, bro, hold on, bro. Wait, wait, hold on, bro. Come on, Jimmy, not you too. Not you too. Look at this. 
What the fuck? Zesty. What? Damn, Jimmy. Damn. So they took this video down, so I guess it's real. I couldn't tell if it was Photoshop or not. Why you let him do this to you? You better have got a bag, nigga. Crazy. <laughs> oh, shit. So Joe Knows tweeted out, man, if you could choose the build system for 2K23, what are you picking? Retweet to get more options. I don't know why you only have... 3,000, it should be way more. What the hell? You must have did it short. But um, the results was double archetypes. I am not surprised by this. <laughs> I'm not surprised by this at all, boy. I don't know why everybody's surprised by this, bro. The golden age of 2K, those people don't play 2K no more. All that's left is all the bots from 18 plus. Like, those are the niggas that's really on this host still or from even newer 2Ks. The, the niggas from back then, they're not even around, bro. They not active, they not following Joe Knows. You know, they don't even care to give their opinion. They been quit this shit, nigga. Cause anyone with a brain that actually played them hoes and really like was in depth of the community, they would understand why those previous builders were way better, man. And um, a lot of people, like the double archetype shit, like it looked pretty, like it, it's, it's it's attractive to people the whole way they had it set up and that's <laughs> if you look like you could do it that's all you need on the internet these days man visual genjutsu the same reason niggas love that bitch nigga itachi bro niggas are obsessed with aesthetics vanity driven creatures man but i want to i want to educate y'all on something if y'all y'all know right double archetypes benefits me a, a creator it benefits only the creator and the company not the consumer y'all realize that right back in the old days niggas will make one to two builds you know their build could do everything two-way players very realistic right um the stats weren't like insane you know it's you had a very realistic game and the builder the builder is low-key irrelevant bro it's low-key all the same shit but it's it's the gameplay dog that makes builds the builds. Way more OP, the, the, when Double Takeover came in the game, shit was broken, nigga. Shit, shit was stiff out. The birth of the post score, the most broken nigga ever, the stretch big, the Double Takeovers. You were really making uh, demigods with this Double Archetype shit. So low key people, you know, people are saying they want role players type shit, but I don't know, man. I guess y'all just wanna spend like over a thousand dollars every 2K cycle or more because when you have a role playing 2k man any tweak of the game kind of makes you build like less op and it encourage you to want to make even more builds man and there's so many different builds that would do different things instead of you just having one build but i mean that's probably good for content creators but i mean hey if y'all want to spend all that money <laughs> Fuck it, nigga. I mean, did y'all y'all ever even thought about that? Like in 2K15, bro, I only had in 6'8 all year. All year. I could do everything. What well, what would be the point of making another build? You feel me? There's no point to make another build. But I guess y'all just want to spend all this money, so I mean. But hey man, maybe the longevity of the game is good with um more restricted builds because then niggas can just uh finesse you niggas on youtube <laughs> and then you always think there's you know better builds out there different builds out there it's probably, it's probably better for the game to be honest it probably is but i, I just want to let y'all know because niggas like to to shit on the older uh the golden age of 2k you know just because they wasn't a part of it man i just wanted to let y'all know a beauty that they got away from just to scam you niggas some more but that double takeover shit, that 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 shit really like fucked up the game bad. <laughs> and this complete freedom shit, like, who's voting for this? Like, th that mean like seven three ninety nine speed? Like, what's what's going on? Like, did people understand the question? Do they know what complete freedom means? I mean, there's definitely so many ways they can have a a very cool build. I really do miss the old style of two K, man. I miss Garden Ball myself. Having to rely on niggas is so ass, bro. It's so annoying.
it makes you play the game less and everything. Like you know, you don't want to. You can't go run with ass or people because you have to have someone who could guard ball because you got to use the cheesy uh, PG that don't have as as much defense and it's it's lame, bro. I don't know. Best players in the league, man. They two way stars, nigga. You know, and even even when they do restrict builds and stuff, there's always still two way superstars in the bitch. I mean, despite what people say, there's always these fucking six seven, six eight, six five like gods on that bitch. It's really the gameplay which makes the builder. But I mean, I guess y'all. I guess this is the same reason why everyone is always clicks on build videos, man. Like, y'all think it's something different. <laughs> I don't know what would be wrong with niggas. Y'all love them build videos, man. But the gameplay makes the builder, bro. I'm going to say it again. The gameplay makes the builder. It's, it's not the builder, bro. It's the gameplay. You know, you could have a crate. Bro, you could have a fucking 7-3, 99 speed fucking crazy game. Nigga, if the builder is legit... I mean, not the builder. If the gameplay is legit, contested shots don't go in, paint defense is there, all this shit we complain about, if it's all fixed, that could be a way better. And I'm not advocating for this. I don't want that bullshit. But I'm just saying, like, the builder is irrelevant. It's the gameplay, nigga. Every year, there's always a 99 dunk, 99 speed. It's just how the game is playing, bro. Like, it's the gameplay. It's the gameplay. Gameplay, gameplay, gameplay. That's what matters most, not the building, man. Y'all got to uh, really push for that, bro. It's, it's the gameplay. I don't know. Y'all let me know how y'all feel about it. You can have a full game of fucking 5-2 midgets. But if contested shots don't drop, you know paint defense is fixed defense is buffed you can keep up with the cheese the left right then post scoring shit don't go in all all this shit you know the competent part of the community wants like you know it's it's the gameplay anywho make sure y'all uh subscribe if you know hit that like button man gonna be covering all the 2k23 news they finna start dropping a bunch of crazy stuff man i'm gonna break it down and give you the real honest opinion no double twist gawking a fucking billion dollar company over here be covering all the best builds when the game drop best dribble moves best jump shots tips and hilarious uh toxic gameplay man turn on them noties man but hey hey here we go again yeah. here, here we go again people talking this but when this hit the fan everything i'm that made me now break it down yo off the top of the dome, dome.